Hey everybody, welcome to Cooking with Tovia. I am Chef Tovia and I bring you detailed step-by-step -step tutorials to help you all become better cooks and bakes at home. Please subscribe for new videos every Monday at midnight Eastern Standard Time. Don't forget to follow me on social media and Facebook at Cooking with Tovia and on Instagram at Tovia Gartenberg. And hey, right after this intro, it's a recipe card where you'll get the recipe for today's demo. Please subscribe and hit the bell so you'll be notified of my new uploads and live events. So let's begin with today's demo. So these lockers are gonna be made, and instead of them being fried, they're gonna be cooked on a waffle iron. So I'm gonna shred my potatoes. So I'm going to dump my potatoes into the bowl. And if you have a cheesecloth or a kitchen towel or something of that nature, we're um, going to just squeeze all the water out. If you don't have a cheesecloth, you can squeeze a little bit of the water out at a time with using your hand. And then after you squeeze all the water out, you just transfer that into another bowl. Okay, so I just want to show you all, I got all the potatoes here drained. And this is all the water that came out of the potatoes. So I got here one egg. And I'm going to add to it. And I'm going to mix the egg in with the potatoes. And I'm heating my waffle iron. Um, I'm going to have it on, on my waffle iron, I'm going to have it on almost completely high. Three is the highest setting, so I'm going to have it on about two and a half. Okay, so I'm going to add to this an onion. And I just sort of chop. And then I have here some salt, pepper, um, garlic powder, and paprika. I'm just going to get that all mixed together. I'm going to add some flour. And mix the flour in. So I got my waffle iron here. It's, it's been preheating. And I'm going to brush it down with a little bit of oil. Just to make it non stick. And then what I'm going to do is just place a couple of tablespoons of the potato latte mixture just over the waffle iron. You don't have to cover the entire waffle iron, but just to make, enough to make a decent sized latte. And then I'm going to Close the waffle iron down, close it, and I'm going to let it cook until the ready light comes on. Guys, okay, so the green light came on, my ready light came on, and here it is. You have a potato latke. I can't find my, and just set it aside. And I'm going to cook all my potato latke the same way. So here it is. I'm gonna cut into it. I garnish the top with sour cream and parsley. Just wanted to pull it so you can see what it looks like. Let's see all the potatoes and the onions. Mmm. This is absolutely delicious. The potatoes are nice and creamy on the inside. And we have a nice crunch on the outside. If you want to keep these crisp, just put them in the oven at 200 degrees Fahrenheit. So that way they can remain crisp until you serve them. I hope you guys try this recipe and enjoy it. Please give me a thumbs up. Please share this video and subscribe if you aren't subscribed. And hit the bell so you'll be notified of my new uploads. 
And stay tuned, guys. I will be giving away two Geek Chef stand mixers. So be sure you subscribe and watch my videos so you know when the contest is happening. Because one of them are going to be a secret contest. So remember to live and be well. Let's do what we can to come together as a whole. Thank you so much for watching.